What's going on guys, Hi Fighter here, welcome back to their video here on the channel, hopping into some more Until Dawn on the PS5. We're here with Mike and Jessica, we're looking for our cabin to do the sexy time. <laughs> um, yeah, got a decent amount done last episode, this game's starting to really progress now. But let's hop into it. There was a lot of jump scares last, last episode. What is that? What? I'm not sure I want to know. Was that an elk? Or a deer? Whatever it is. Oh, No! Oh, it's hurt. Damn. It's horrible. Uh, Gee, I don't think he's gonna make it. <laughs> yeah, I don't think it's gonna make it either. Oh, I wanna kill it. Comfort it. Feel bad. Hey, bud. Hey, buddy. God, the poor thing. It's okay. Mike, it's in so much pain. It'll be over soon. Oh god, his head is hanging off the thing. It's horrible. Oh! Okay, okay. Um, go, 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 go. Oh lord, QTEs. <laughs> Shut up, Jess. I'm trying to run. Okay, let's be risky and go. Go, 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 go. Let's be cool and go, go, go. Let's be cool and go, go, go. Yeah, come on up, girl. Please hurry up. <laughs> Alright, easy. Made it up. There we go. There's the cabin. Oh. Jess, really? Oh, God. <laughs> I, I I'm trying to help you get up. Get it open. Oh my god. That was close. Oh my lord, dude. What? Had it under control. Full time. <laughs> Bullshit. No, 100%. 100%. 110%. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't think you did. Holy crap. You were I screaming and running like a baby. Going. I think we kind of did. Was it a bear? Yeah. Gotta be. Things are crazy fast. I mean, I didn't see it. I don't think that was a bear. I come barging in, I promise. How can you be sure? Cause I'm pretty sure bears don't know how to open cabin doors. I've seen them open car doors. What? Where? On the internet. Really? Okay. Well, this isn't the internet, Jess. Right? This is real <laughs> life. And I promise you that no bear or anything else is gonna open that cabin door. I guess you're right. Okay, I'm almost feeling relaxed again. Almost. And there's huh. no power. Typical. Burr. This is not the cozy. What does she always say, burr? Mike. Yeah, it's a bit drafty or something, right? Well, there is a fireplace. Well, we don't need a fire to heat things up. <laughs> Michael, I am a lady, and a lady needs a proper romantic setting. Okay. A lady would like to cuddle up with her man by a nice cozy fire bathed in atmospheric mood lighting. Right. It'll get plenty toasty once we're rubbing up against each other. <laughs> My yeah. fire and mood lighting. <laughs> yes. Fire and Malik. mood lighting. Okay. Gotta do everything for you. Huh, Jess? Oh, you sit there and complain. What the? Oh. And she forgot her phone. Fuck, Mike. What? Oh, crap. She what? dropped it somewhere. Where is it? What? What's wrong? Gone. It is gone, okay? Yes. slow down. What is gone? My freaking phone, Sherlock. Can't find it? Crap, no. I must have dropped it outside. Oh. Yeah. I can't lose my phone. My parents will kill me. You can always get a new one. That's like my fourth one this year. Okay. Okay. Jeez. Well, I'll help you look for it. It's got to be outside. Yeah. I don't think we want to go out there right now with the bear or whatever it is. Fine. 
Uh, fine. Yeah. We're not going out there. Hey, a lighter. Or a match, so I mean. Lookie, lookie. Who's gonna fire up some nookie? You've been dying these outlines oh since God. we got here, haven't you? Yeah. Oh. oh There's a gun here. Look at this. Is it a fire? No. Way cooler. A sniper. I'm not gonna scare her. Huh? How you like me now? <laughs> Why do guns make men go completely bonkers? <clears throat> Nothing. Right. <laughs> yeah. Put that away. She'll never understand what we have to go. <laughs> okay, weirdo. Oh wait, there's something over here. A book. Native American Myths and Legends by I Joseph Malik. I'm reading. Shut it. The mother bear returned. She was enraged and attacked the merchant, but he managed to escape with her cub's pelts. A mighty eagle saw this and swooped at the merchant as he ran through the trees, but a gunshot frightened the eagle away. The merchant was leaving the forest and was gleeful, thinking of the money that would soon be his. But a great tree fell, blocking his way. He had to turn back and find another route. Shut up. And this is... And that is where we, he met the bear once more. The great spirit stopped him that day, and the bear had its revenge. The, to anger the earth is to sacrifice your life. The great spirit sees all. Remember that, and be your, and be wary. Respect is the way of the tribe. I'm trying to read, okay? So we weren't the only ones to meet the friendly neighborhood terror. Native bear. American book. That does not make me feel any better. Native American signs and symbols. Native American hunters use symbols and signs scratched on. The trees are daubed onto walls to communicate with other tribe members. Many symbols conveyed religious or mystical beliefs. Others warned of danger or offered protection, and some told of good hunting grounds. Most symbols were specific to the tribe that used it and would be unrecognizable to other tribes. Shown below and opposite are some symbols used by tribes in North America and Canada. What? <laughs> Image of a hunter symbol, good hunting ground, image of a butterfly symbol, a vision or dream of the future, and an image of a skull symbol, a ward or spell protecting against evil spirits. Uh, I was trying to read, lady. Okay? I'll get your fire going soon. I'm reading. Okay, so leave me alone. Nice. I'll lighten up the mood a little. Oh. <laughs> hey, why are you okay? What are you doing? It's no power. It's the lights. I know it's the lights, dummy. You broke them. <laughs> it's probably faulty wiring or something. You've got faulty wiring. <laughs> wow. Oh. Is that Hannah? It's Hannah's photo. Hannah winning bronze, Alberta, at the Alberta Junior Invitational to 2013. I was trying to read on the left, but let's read the transcript. Okay, I know I need to light the fire, but I'm just going to look around, get this stuff really cool, really first, so I don't have to deal with anything later, because I don't want to miss anything. The Kama Sutra, edited by Tom Heaton. Wait, isn't this about like, yeah? Oh, it's hell about yeah. sex. These guys are inventive. <laughs> when one of the lovers presses with force one or both of the thighs of the other between his or her own, it is called a clasping of thighs. Ooh. Various manifold uses of pleasure in all its highest spiritual and physical forms. What a husband must desire most profoundly in his wife or mistress. Thus must the wife or mistress most ecstatically return. The many and intimate delights of the flesh are an expression both of worldly affection and spiritual oneness. Hence, when the husband takes the position known as the elephant rising, the wife responds with that known by the ancients as the swan in splendor. The advanced position known as the hermit plays his lyre is often coupled with one which goes by many names, but is commonly called the Daisy Plumes. What? 
Oh Fuck. my gosh. I'm not sure if I'm ready for such advanced levels of game play. <laughs> when one kisses the image of a person reflected in a mirror or in water, or his own shadow on the wall, it is the kiss of declaration. When the woman places either thigh across that of her lover, it is called the entwined position. Oh my god, dude. I love how I'm just reading this. I feel awkward reading that. Give me one sec, Jess. I'm looking at things and I'll be right out. Anything else? Can I get a shower? <laughs> Bro, what? <laughs> Are you kidding me? There's gonna be a jump scare instead he gets stuck on that. <laughs> okay, Mike. You really are a wimp. Anything in here? Nope. Alright, Jess, I'm gonna light your fire now. I was just being cool and exploring. But you're to keep complaining if I don't, so... Here you go. Oh wait, this is not even the freaking fire. Ah, this'll take care of the mood lighting. Okay. Light that bad boy. Man one, fire zero. Very nice. <laughs> Bravo. Mood lighting. All right, my lady. What comes next? I think. Well, I I wish we had some booze. Uh. Well, uh, if I'd known that ahead of time. I don't know. I'm kind of just. I'm not feeling it yet. Let's just make out. I mean, let me reassure. I don't want to be kind of rude. Let's reassure. Am I doing something wrong? No, 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 no. I mean, I thought you were one way, but you're kind of another way. Does if that make sense? It's it's not your fault. Uh, Jess, I really like you. Whoever you think I am. Well, just give me a chance, and I will show you what you need. <laughs> well, I am liking your confidence. Mike, the shutters. What about them? Um, close them, please? <laughs> <laughs> There's just no one out there. I feel like someone's watching us. I don't like it. Yes, really, it's fine. I really don't like it. Well, well something is watching us. <laughs> I'm just waiting out there. Am I going to get attacked by going to do this? Okay, does that work? Voila. Voila. Shutters are shut it. <laughs> so stupid. I'm sorry. Mm. I'm sorry. I think I'm a little freaked out, and it's hard for me to like keep this up. And what? Keep, keep what? Up. Look, I act all super confident and like a total sexy babe and everything, but underneath, <laughs> I gotta be honest. I'm really kind of insecure. Oh. I'll be reassuring. Jesus. You've got to be kidding me. Is our relationship going up? Yeah. What? You have nothing to be insecure about. Oh. <laughs> you have no idea. Sure I do. You're just like me and everyone else. We're all insecure. But you know how to handle yourself. You might call it a front, but it's real. Yeah, I guess I do. Yeah, and that's super fucking hot. <laughs> really? Yeah, hell yeah it is. Come here. Ooh. Maybe I know how to handle you too. Ooh. I'm definitely ready to be handled. <laughs> oh god. 
I like how we're doing this right now with this thing watching us. Oh. Taking the clothes off. Why are you watching us? Ooh. Oh my god. Oh, uh, what? what is I don't know. Why is there music I'll playing? Now, now, please. Oh my god, why do I have to do everything? Can I force you to do it? What is that? Why is there just random music playing? Hello? Oh. Is that her phone? Why is her phone... Th did the thing throw her phone through here or what? Or is somebody out there messing with us? Just soons. Yeah, it is her phone. What? How is it my phone? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know, it just... Came through the window. Oh, for fuck's sake, god damn it! What? Those... Goddamn assholes probably followed us out here to fuck with us and just when we were getting down to business. <laughs> she is pissed. Hey! Yeah, bricks! That means you! I know you're out there. What the fuck are you trying to do? You wanna ruin our fun that bad? That thing is right there. <laughs> That's right. We are going to have sex, and it's gonna be hot. So <laughs> okay. Enjoy it because I know we're going to. <sighs> yep. Give me a break. <sighs> Dude, what? It's so weird. Oh! Oh, Jessica. Oh no. <laughs> Dude, I remember that scene. Now, I forgot that happened right there. Well, that, she was actually taken this time. Frickin' mead. Oh. Do you really think the girls were communicating with us? I don't know. Back of Ashley and Chris. If I wish they were, if I wish they weren't. I guess we should find out. Was there anything even up here? I think we kind of already found everything. Oh, wait, there's this thingy. Was this here before? No. Josh looked really freaked out. Maybe we weren't here before. <gasps> oh, Hannah's glasses case. Oh. Okay. Well, that's something new. I don't remember that even from when I played this game the first time. Yeah, I mean, he, he looked like he was keeping it together, but. I think we should have mentioned. Well, he cracked history. there. That's why we came back up here. Yeah. But not to, like, have a seance. Maybe we went too far. Well, oh, there's a totem right here. Wanna pick it up? Ashley? 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 <laughs> pick up the totem. Ba da da! This is a weird one. What is this? It's like legs? The heck? Hello? Where's the thing on this one? This one has something on it. It's up here. There it is. Got it. Oh. A wolfie. Isn't that one of the wolves that Mike runs into? At that creepy place? Is this locked? Yep. Yep, 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 yep. Everything is locked. Oh, something on the ground. Hello? Can I look at it? Hello? 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 Oh my god, I hate, freaking hate the controls sometimes. What is that? Did, did you see that? Light from below? Yeah. The power's not even on. Under the grate. Weird. Well, maybe the power's not on up here, but someone has the power on down there. Oh lord. 
just throwing right? books around. I think so. Look. What? There was something behind the books. There's a button. What is that? Is it a button? Why would there be a button? That's a good question. Should I push it? It's a secret passage. Before, I, guess. I don't want to press it. You press it. <laughs> I don't want to touch it. Okay, I'll touch it. <laughs> I don't want to do it, Chris. It is, in fact, a secret passage. Are we like in a movie right now? If we are, you're in a video game. Drunk. Leave it to the Washingtons to have secret passages in their house. I mean, maybe they didn't even know this place is super old. So, should we take a look? After you. No, 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 no. <laughs> you go. You're my knight in shining armor. You go. Oh God, what is this camera angle? Oh, okay. Why is there a spider on the screen? Why is the game doing this to me? <laughs> I mean, I'm not that scared of spiders, but why is there a f like I I I'll hold a tarantula, but why does that have to be on the screen? Portrait photo. Whoa. So Hannah and Beth. What? Whoa, is this... What did you find? Oh God, that's written in blood. <laughs> I will take them and bleed them like pigs and rip their soft white skin off. Effing sixteen years. Sixteen years. I waited for pretty little Hannah and Beth. What is wrong with whoever wrote this? Dude. Holy cow. Should I be honest? I don't want to be protected, but I want to be honest. And now, Ash, I, I, I don't want to freak you out, but, but look at this. What? Chris, what is that? I, I think this might be what the spirit board wanted us to find. The clue? Yeah, it's a letter. Let me see it. It's written in blood. Chris, this is serious. We need to find Josh right now. Yeah. I feel like we should do that. Uh. Well, this door is open now. <laughs> Hello? Why are these doors just randomly opening? The heck? If so, that would be really messed up. Yeah. There's a note here. November 8, 2013. Um, race and ethnicity department. Doc Dear Dr. Swaffham, thank you for your response. It's good to know that the tribe still feel an attachment to the land here, even if we have a few unfortunate problems. Graffiti, people sleeping in the outbuildings. This is their ancestral home, after all. I am made contact with the descendants of the tribe and intend to make a donation to their elder council. Healing the wounds of the past won't be easy, but I feel it's a step that is necessary. Yours sincerely, Melinda Washington. On reverse, saw that crazy guy again. Thursday, 9.17 p.m., hanging around the generator shed. I'm going to start keeping a record. Okay, so the creepy guy there. Yeah. Looks like it was written by Josh's mom. Yeah, she's really making an effort to set things right with some native tribe or something. Yep, because yeah, they're goes back a long way. living on their land. Oh god, I hate this. Okay, this is in the main area. I hate how this game is so dark all the time. Okay, why is that locked from the inside now? <laughs> It should only be locked from the outside. That's scary. Are all these doors just locked? Like, is this one locked too? Okay, you can't even do anything with it. So, um, what was that? I've just been thinking about. Just saw something saw pop up. With Sam. What? There was like this wanted poster, like full on Western style, you know. So. And Sam really thought there was someone following her around. So. So what you're saying, there's some criminal up on the mountain with us? There was a message on this answering machine I found, and it, it, it was from this sergeant saying that there was this guy who had just gotten out of prison and there was nothing he could do. What do you mean? He was saying it like, like a warning. I mean, maybe that's whoever was down in the basement before. What? Oh, jeez. Under the floorboards in the library, the light. Yeah. There was that guy I told you well, about. Wait, 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 what guy? The guy who threatened the Washingtons. I mean, he, he said he wanted to take revenge by burning the whole place down. 
And then I found that crazy psycho letter. Chris, if this is your way of trying to make me feel better, you're fired. <laughs> oh, no. You hear that? Oh, Wait, is that Josh? Coming from the kitchen. Josh! Josh! We're coming! Oh! Uh, Ashley? What the heck? Let me in. Uh, Ashley. What is happening? Okay? Hello? Jeez. Oh, God. Uh oh. Oh! Oh, frick me. <laughs> Hi. This is a creepy psycho dude. Ew. No, what are you doing? <laughs> oh my god. Why are you taking her away? You're just leaving me there. So, is this the creepy psycho dude? That we were talking about? <laughs> um... Hi! Oh god. Why is there a freaking weird, uh, clown bloody thing there? Why is your room getting creepy? I mean, you already were creepy, so... This is stepping it up a notch. I'm going to show you some, uh, pictures of people that you have come to know. Like. Oh. Maybe you don't like them as much as you pretend to. Well, this is an exercise in honesty. Tell me which person from each pair you like the most. Take your time. Your answers are important. <laughs> um, okay. I prefer Sam over Josh. I... Josh is not... I don't... I mean, he's... I like he's kind of funny, but I don't really... It's kind of weird. <laughs> kind of creepy. So, Sam. Matt or Emily? Oh, God. Okay, so, Emily is kind of a B, but I kind of like her. I don't know. If you play as her later, like, later on, I kind of like her more than Matt, but I kind of like Matt more now. I'm going to go Emily, but Matt's still a good dude. I prefer Chris. Ashley, I don't like you. <laughs> I she's kind of annoying, honestly. Sorry. Oh no no no! I prefer Chris. I mean, I meant to get rid of Ashley. I do not prefer Ashley. Sorry. <laughs> Whoops. So glad I did not hold that completely down. Um. I prefer Mike. Sorry, Jessica. Okay, what the hell are you staring at me for? I prefer Matt. Yeah, Josh, you are going to be at like one of one of the bottom of the list for me, unfortunately. You are very weird and creepy. Make me uncomfortable. Ooh, in this case, I like. I think I like Jessica more. I didn't really. I like Mike more from that pair, but I prefer Jessica. I Ashley's kind of annoying to me. Kind of annoying. She does something really stupid later on. Tell me, in this little game you're playing so diligently, who is it that you most dislike? Okay. Um. God, dude. I I think I don't. I think I dislike Josh. Ashley's a little bit higher than Josh for me. I I like I like Josh. Like again, he's like kind of funny, but he's just I don't. He's just a little bit weird. I don't care for him. Full of I feel bad, though. I think I'm beginning to understand you far better now. Oh. I'm afraid. Once again, we're out of time. Don't be too hard on Joshua. He's been through. He's been through so much. But you know that already, don't you? <laughs> yeah. I've been playing the game. What the hell? Like, why is that there? <laughs> Why do you have that there, sir? 
You're creepy and weird. Chapter 4. Malevolence. Seven hours until dawn. This game is a lot longer than I remember. Oh wait, so we're back with freaking Mike after that. Jessica! Jessica! I remember that. Jessica! Oh my god. Oh my god. She just got ripped out of there, dude. Yeah, we gotta run, dude. <laughs> gotta find her. Follow the path. Okay, what I remember seeing, I think you have to go quick here, because if you don't, you can get end up getting chest killed if you aren't quick enough. So I think you have to do the risky stuff. So to do the QTs. And not fail them. Gotta be a smart boy here. Let's go. Let's go. Jessica! Jessica! <laughs> Jessica! Alright. Gotta go down this way. Yep. Oh god, wait, what am I looking at? Oh! There she is! Oh god, what is taking her away? Uh, I gotta, I gotta honestly I have to go quick. I have to jump down. Oh my lord, oh my lord, oh my lord. There we go. Nice and easy. Good boy. Okay, get your gun. Let's go. Nice. Good boy. Keep on, keep it on. Just like death training. Nice. Good boy. So sleek and smooth. Okay. Gotta jump. Gotta be quick. Gotta be quick here, just don't screw up. Easy. Nice. We are so quick with this. Where is she? Okay, we gotta be quick. Be risky. Opportunity strikes for the man who takes it! Oh lord. Oh god. Is this gonna break? Oh, no. Just hop down. One, one. Let's go, Mikey boy. <laughs> Let's go, Mikey boy. There you go. Nice and easy. God, that would look like a hurt. <laughs> if I broke something from trying to land on that. She's still there. She's being dragged away. Jess. Oh, we're going to the mine. There she is. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Why is the door just closed? Where'd she go? God, why am I running? Why am I walking again? I'm not running anymore. Why am I walking? There, I'm kind of running. Run faster, Mike. Wait, is there anything? Sorry, Jess. I need to make sure I didn't miss anything. Okay, we're good. <laughs> Sorry, Jess. I'm looking for totems. Can I run down the stairs? I hate that you can only walk. Jessica! Jessica! Wait, is there anything? Is that a totem? No. Just want to make sure is isn't something hidden. Sorry, Jess. I'm looking for things, okay? Is that where she went? Or did she go this way? She went the other way. There is a totem here, though. There it is. Oh god. Okay, that's Matt. He's in the mine. Alright. Well, now the game is really kicking off, dude. Got Ashley taken, and we have Jessica being taken down in the mine. Michael! Michael! Oh! Um, hi. Why do I feel like something bad's about to happen? No! Oh, God! 
But she's still alive. No, she's not dead. Oh my God. She's alive, see? Yes. Yes. Jess. Okay? <laughs> oh! Ah, oh, frick me. I okay. Yep. Yeah, she. That's with from that premonition. She falls down the thing. Hi. Hello. What are you? Oh, hi. Okay. That's that creepy. So that's, that's that creature thing that ripped her down there. Okay. Come on, Mikey boy. Oh lord, so QTEs. All right, we're being a climber boy now. Be quick. Be quick, boy. Nice. Good job. Nice. Good job, dude. Nice. Nice, Saru. Good. Okay. Oh, okay. I knew something bad was gonna happen. But luckily, I am quick. I am a smart boy. Okay, jumping across. Yep. Nice. Oh. Hi. But. Wait, I shouldn't shoot him though. Is he the... He's not the psycho, I don't think. He's not wearing the mask. Who's this guy? I don't think I should shoot him. Oh. There's no freaking ammo in there anyway. <laughs> so I tried to shoot him and wouldn't have done anything. Uh oh. Oh no. Oh no. Oh god. Oh lord. Okay, we got it. Dude, what would happen if I didn't make it there? Oh, it's a random lantern here for me. Cool. I appreciate it. Now I'm in the mine. Deep down, deep down in the mine. Okay. Dude, the game is really kicking off now, though. So Jess fell really far down. Oh, God. Mike's tweaking out. Just fall, fell really far down, and now Mike's looking for her. anything over here. Why is there nothing? Why is there nothing here? What? What was the point of even coming through here? This is a dead end. Why do you have dead ends, game? I can run again. Oh, there's some old stuff down here. Okay. And better. December 12, 1951, to Mr. Henry Caldwell. This is an old letter. For the attention of the Blackwood Bragg mining crew, subsequent to recent inspection, I am pleased to report that the Blackwood Bragg mine and associated facilities have exceeded all safety code requirements stipulated in Alberta provincial law um, certification forthcoming can't even speak we commend our diligent engineering and maintenance staff for ensuring the well-being of our valued employees please keep up the good work and the knowledge that the company puts your our put your safety first yours sincerely jefferson bragg the blackwood bragg mining company mr bragg i was most su surprised to receive such a glowing report on the state of the facility and felt compelled to reply to the contra contrary to the contrary these mines are poorly maintained and dangerous. They are flooded throughout. Countless stoles are rotting. Equipment is old and wiring is faulty. The men get sick down there at an alarming rate, which is only made worse by the meager supply of rations. Hell, most of us aren't even convinced the mine is clear of critters. God only knows what's down there. Perhaps your sanatorium up the mountain might show us the care your mining companies singularly failing to provide down here. Henry Caldwell, chief of the Blackwood Mine Blasting Crew. So uh, the sanatorium is that place you find the wolves, I think. I'm pretty sure. Anything else to pick up over here? So 
So we got some old 1950s stuff going on here. From the mine. Anything back here? Okay, there is something. A totem. Okay. Got some good totems going on here. There it is. Okay, is that... Is that Jessica? Who was that? Other hunger totem. Who was that in the premonition, though? It was a girl. So one of the girl characters, <laughs> yeah. There's a lot of them. Could also be like Emily or something. There's a newspaper here. Hello? Not anything to pick up in here? Can I not read that newspaper? That sucks. Wait, really? I can't read the newspaper? I feel like you could read that. What's the point of having this here, then? Really, game? There's a note there, too. I can't read any of this. What? There we go. Are we out? Alright, well, we're out. <laughs> She got, she just fell really far down. Can't really get to her. That sucks. You should have put a jacket on, dude. Oh. Jesus. The fuck is that place? That's the sanatorium. Oh, our boy's up there. The guy w w that we saw before. And Chris is back up. Jeez, dude. Oh no. So where's Ashley? God. Ashley! <laughs> he got pounded in the face. Oh. They got hurt. Ashley. Ash. Ash. This is locked. Ash. Yep. Really? Where is she? She got dragged away by the creeper dude. I also still don't think that that one guy that we saw with Mike isn't the guy with the psycho mask. Not good. That's her. Not good at all. Wallet or something. Okay. 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 I don't think there's anything in here. Maybe behind. The kitchen counter, but that's, I don't think there's gonna be anything. Pretty much empty in here. No, there's literally nothing. Obs. Oh wait, is that something? No, it's just a glow. It's the glow of my light. God, I got effed up, dude. What the? Fuck? Oh. Um. I'm sorry. What? Is that blood? Oh shit. No. Oh no. No, it's not Ashley. She got dragged away. But what 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 is all what is that blood from though? Well it's definitely not Ashley, but jeez. Ash Oh god. Where did he take her? Anything over here? No. Can I run? Ashley! Please. I would appreciate being able to run. <laughs> I don't Ashley! like having. Oh yeah, I was like, I don't like having to walk everywhere. Anyone out there, Ashley? Ashley. Hello? <laughs> what is that? Oh god, is that that? It's that freaking pig's head again. Oh! Oh my god, dude. Freaking clown. I <laughs> guess that's psycho, dude. Ew. Ew. What's wrong with him? Is that, a, is that that freaking pig's head? What is this? Oh, 
Oh shit. Oh. Pig's head. Frick me, dude. Why is there a random thing that just pops up here? Stop with the random jump scares game. Come on. <laughs> trying to explore and find totems and stuff, and then <laughs> I have that happen to me. Really? Where is she? Ash. He brought her really far away. Okay, maybe up here. Ash. This feels Ash. like somewhere the guy brought her. Ash. Okay. Just uh, another totem, I think. Yep. <clears throat> A lot of totems this episode. Oh, I just saw it. I think. There it is. Oh! Oh god, somebody just got effed up. That looked like Chris, maybe. I don't know who that was. Could have been Chris. Somebody just did, at least. <laughs> okay. Well, that's a death totem. I feel like she might be here. Ashley? Is she here? Ash. Hello? Oh god, I think she's in there. There's a path leading in there, like footprints. I'm not going to go in there yet because I want to look around. Just to make sure I didn't, not, there's nothing hidden over here. I don't really think there is, but we'll see. No. There isn't. Yeah, she's definitely in there. There's nowhere else to go from here. Yep. Oh, God. I do not like this. Ashley! Yeah, I hear her. <gasps> oh, no, 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 no. Is the door locked? No. God. Ashley? You good? Oh. Uh, hey. Oh! Dude. Uh, I'm coming, Ash. Just, uh, just keep talking to me. Is she what over? Happened? Where is she? Ashley, I'm gonna get what? you out of this. Don't worry. I'm really scared, Chris. Wait, is she? Oh, she's in there. Hurry, Hello. Please. Wait, is she in here? Hello. <gasps> oh. God. Wait. Chris, are you there? Oh no no no! And thank you all for joining me. Oh my God, Josh, wake up! Tonight, what? We're gonna what is this? A little experiment. Oh God! I know what's gonna make me do. I, I forgot about this. <laughs> oh no! Oh no! Oh my God! We're gonna need one more brave participant to help decide which subject. Oh no! Everyone calm down. It's all very simple. Christopher, you will find a lever placed directly in Oh, front. no. All you have to do is choose who you will save. Oh, God, no. No, 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 no. <laughs> okay, I know who I'm going to pick. <laughs> oh, and I feel horrible. <laughs> Oh no. Oh god. Okay, I I sorry Josh. I like Ashley more and she is Chris's crush, so oh god. I'm sorry, Josh. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I am freaking sorry. Oh god, I think that means it goes towards him. Yep! Oh no! Oh no! Chris said he would save Ashley. Oh god. Mike successfully chased after Jessica. 
Wait, Jessica resisted Mike's advances. Oh. That's sad. Wait, is that bad that I did that then? Oh. God, why does he look like that in the- Oh, no. I- <laughs> Hey, Josh! Oh, God, this could be very bad. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, God! <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. Oh my god. Okay. Josh. Oh my lord. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, Josh, dude. Don't look. Okay, and you looked anyway. Okay. Okay. <laughs> what the frick me, dude? I am so sorry, Josh. I need to say my girl here. Oh. Chris. Matt and Emily. Ashley. God. What? what? Whose blood is that, Ash? Are you okay? Chris, what happened? Josh. Josh, what, dude? He said. Wait, no, what? Right in front of us, man. What are you talking the, the about? Maniac. The maniac. Oh my god, we gotta get out of here. I don't understand what happened. The maniac. And he was, there was a sign. <laughs> it was either him or Ash. And I, I don't know. Oh god. <laughs> Come right through, man. Spill it out fucking everywhere. What? Jeez. Oh, oh my god, Chris. I <sighs> killed him. What, oh, Chris? Maybe you shouldn't be saying that. <laughs> I mean, kind of no, did kill him, but okay. Matt, we need to go get help now. Em, we should look for the others. Mike and Jess are off 69ing each other, and who knows where <laughs> Sam is? I think she's in the lodge. Fine, fine, you're right. Get everyone else together. But if there's a maniac running around, I think we need to get some help too, right? Not just wait around. Yeah. But what about- Why are we still talking about this? Let's go! <laughs> that was a weird freaking pause there. It's a millennial pause right there. <laughs> Why did freaking Emily look like that at the end? That's funny. Okay. Hi, sir! Oh god, why is that thing there again? Hi! Why is your room getting creepier and creepier? Hello again. Things are getting pretty tense up there, aren't they? Yeah. Is the night going the way you hoped it would? <laughs> Not really. Um. Oh God. Okay. I always trying to speak. This. It's. I kind of. I kind of miss the. Um. The. Uh, the cutscenes that would happen after like the chapters end. Like it would kind of be like the recap. Kind of missed that a little bit. I was trying to say that before and I forgot to say it. It's not going how I thought it was gonna go. <laughs> it's not going good. And you think that these poor people are getting what they deserve? No. They don't deserve that. What do you want? Who are you? I mean, what do you want? I guess. I'm trying to help you. And this game you're playing, you understand that it's not good for you. It's not good for anyone. <laughs> and I yeah. can't say that you're being particularly honest in the way you're playing. Well, I had to choose someone to die. What am I supposed to do? <laughs> what are you freaking talking about, man? <laughs> God, you are getting so creepy. Okay, well... Oh! Intend to continue with this elaborate. Oh my God! Why dungeons. are you so creepy? You're freaking me out, man. Do you even believe that I am real? <laughs> no, you do not exist because you're really creepy and you do stuff like this. Like it. The heart of the problem. It all comes down to this. Can you really count the difference anymore? <laughs> Not exactly, but you seem really creepy. You seem too creepy to be real. <laughs> Ooh. I feel like he's like um he's like the uh freaking I 
came to speak. He's like the the voice inside the psycho's mind or something. Chapter five, dread. Six hours until dawn. Still got like six more chapters, basically, or I guess five more, technically. Oh, back with Matt, Jeez. Mike. Back with Matt, Mike. <laughs> That's oh God. Good. That's really not good. That's our creepy dude over there. I still don't think he's a psycho. He seems like he's a different guy. Oh, there's our wolf friend. Hi. How's it going? Uh, hello? Is that just showing me the way in? <laughs> I guess. Damn it. Is he that? Oh, wait, is this. Is that the dude? Like, this, the, the guy that's the Milgram dude? He's like the wanted guy? Cause he looks as, he looks old enough to be that dude that's from the um the like the the note the guy that was threatening to like burn the house down and stuff. Okay, don't die, Mike, please. Ow, you're good. A little bit dirty, but you're good. All right, people, this is a good place to end it for today. Mike is heading into the sanatorium, heading after this creepy guy. Probably the wanted dude from the note. Uh, you guys did enjoy. Make sure to hit the like button, hit the subscribe button below if you haven't already. Uh, we are also going to be seeing more about uh, what's going on. Oh, God. we J Josh is not doing too hot. <laughs> He's kind of gone. Um, but that's still going on. We haven't seen Sam in a while. Is she in the She's probably in the bath, though, I think. Isn't she in the bath? I don't remember. Um... Matt and Emily are kind of back hanging out with Chris and Ashley trying to find Sam. So, I guess so. Anyway, guys, I'll see you in the next one. Adios, people. Until dawn. We'll be coming back next time. Bye-bye.